Hello, hello everybody. And this is my Skittle Shrimp Tank and I'm going to do a shrimp feeding experiment on this tank. Since this is my Skittles, aka call tank, there are always lots and lots of shrimp coming and going out of this tank. And so instead of overfeeding like I have done in the past to make sure I'm throwing in enough I want to get a good gauge on how much food I need to put in here especially when it comes to algae wafers the problem with algae wafers is what don't get ate quick just sits there until all the snails consume it and you end up feeding three-fourths of the food I throw in there to the snails and so I'm trying to fix that and so here in this 40 gallon Skittle shrimp tank with probably two or 3,000 shrimp, I am going to throw in a single Hikari algae wafer. Now this is the same package you get anywhere. This is just the kilogram, 2.2 pounds size that you might say is professional use size. So I get those, you get them at a pretty good price when you buy that many of them and one single algae wafer that's it that's all that i'm putting in here and now let's see what ensues it's pretty crazy stick around to the end because it's awesome
All right, everyone, if you're still here, after about three and a half hours, you can see there's still tons of shrimp out everywhere, but I see no noticeable signs of pieces of algae wafers. I think they're just little bits that have flaked off and, you know, they smell the little bits of algae wafers and they're out. Looking for anywhere the algae wafer piece was in the last couple hours, the shrimp, I think, can smell it. And there might be little tiny pieces that I can't see, we can't see, but the shrimp know they're there and they're over there cleaning up the leftovers. So. Hopefully this video ended up being kind of fun to watch. So many different colored shrimp in one video, time lapse, you know, everyone knows. You know. If you guys have been around though, I like to play around with time lapse. It's one of my new favorite toys to play with. So, I guess I ain't new, but. Anyway, fun little experiment. Now I have a better idea. I think one algae wafer is enough. When I do feed algae wafers, I don't really feed too many algae wafers. Because it seems to make snails grow like crazy so I try to stay away from them it's just for treats and to get them out of the op out in the open for videos like this and calling and I do like to feed them in I like to watch them and the skills tank is one of my favorite tanks to watch just because all the variety of the colors and so many of them in here might be one of my personal favorite tanks as far as sitting and watching just because all the different colors so, thank you guys for watching. I hope this was somewhat entertaining. Bye.